Okay, so what we've got here is a vintage uh, Radio Shack Quick Printer 2. For a while there it was Tandy's cheapest printer. It was only about 300 odd dollars. Uh, this one comes with, a, with one roll of spare printer paper. As you can see it uses very hard to read silver aluminized paper um, it's about two and a bit uh, inches wide uh, has a couple of controls on the side there for um, choosing serial or parallel port um, as well as online offline and testing uh, on the back you've got connections for parallel port there uh, Model 1 bus there, so you can use this printer on a Model 1 without an expansion interface and a COCO compatible serial uh, port there and a power switch there. I'll show you how it, uh, how it works. Um, when you switch it on it does a self test and the um, online offline button on the side also functions as a self-test so each time I hit that it um, prints printer ready on the paper so there you have it uh, this is a 240 volt one from Australia um, so it's not one of my US imports you can plug it in and use it here if you want like I said comes with another roll of paper um, quite hard to find printers these ones because they're a little bit limited in their in their usefulness they were cheap but uh, most people found that if they were paying three hundred dollars for one of these they could spend you know another hundred and fifty or so dollars and get a full-sized paper printer but they're an interesting little printer so if you're interested um, have a look on eBay or my website Quick Printer 2 by Tandy, 1982. Thanks for watching.